What's going on YouTube? This video is just to show the two new fish kind of settling in. Um, sorry, I just fed them so it's kind of a bit cloudy. Let me find them here. Here is the Tyrannochromus Niagara Venter. Sell them pretty good. He's got some uh, surprisingly good color for the size he is. He's probably barely five inches. Um, so I'm, I'm not convinced that he's going to hold that color, you know, in here with some of these bigger guys. You can see they're still not quite used to him yet, but hey, I'm happy with him. And the other guy is the Dimidiochromus Kiwingi. There he is. Got just the slightest hint of color, but, uh, you know, if you research Kiwingis, they don't color up really, really fast like some of the other Dimidiochromus do, like the Strigatus or a, a Decomp or anything like that. They take a little bit more time. So really, when I order fish like that, that are uncommon and a little more difficult to find, I'm pretty much satisfied as long as I'm sure that they're males. Um, just because I, I really enjoy watching them grow out. So I know it sounds a little odd, but I would rather have them come in, you know, a little bit small and not fully colored up as opposed to coming in, you know, full grown at max color. Just because I enjoy seeing the transformation of the fish. So this, this order really worked out well for me. You can see everyone else is still doing well. We'll get a side shot here. I don't know if I've given a side shot lately, but uh, again, sorry for the cloudiness with uh, having just fed. Again, this Strigatus was a real dick for like three days to those two new fish. He finally got over it. I don't know what his deal was, but he's over it now, so whatever dude <laughs> so if that Niagara Venter can hold his color I'd really be happy with that but I'm not really expecting him to so everyone as a whole doing really well getting along um, as of right now I'm not really having any aggression, aggression issues at all knock on wood Thanks for watching, guys.